Since the killing of George Floyd, many people across the country have showed their support for Black Lives Matter, including this church here in Laurel. You can't miss the signs outside of Oakland Presbyterian Church when you drive past it on Interstate 197 in Laurel. Black Lives Matter signs outside of the church, each with a different message. We wanted people to be able to see kind of in a staggered response as they're driving by, like, love God, love neighbor, Black Lives Matter. Sort of that repetitive, stoic, like, this is who we are, this is what scripture says. A recent article on the ChristianChronicle.org website titled, Why the Black Lives Matter Movement is so controversial to Christians, spells out the difficulty churches are facing trying to discuss Black Lives Matter. The church elders at Oakland Presbyterian are wholeheartedly behind the movement. We are highly supportive. We don't march because we're old and um, COVID sensitive. So, um, but we support financially and emotionally. Members Jesse Littlejohn and Betsy Weisbrod spearheaded the charge. And it's a huge gift to be able to be a part of a community that allows all of our members to have a voice and not just the members, but to speak it out to the community. Because we don't just live in the walls of the church, especially now with COVID, <laughs> um, you know, we, we live in a community and we have to support each other and we have to show love and grace to everyone. In a statement about the signs, the church writes, while this is a season of mourning, it is our responsibility as a church, as a community, to speak truth to power. The leadership team, I, I tell them, as long as what they're doing is furthering love and wholeness in the world, then I will always support them. For 12-year-old Oswald Ayukata, seeing a Black Lives Matter sign outside of an establishment means more than just a statement. To him, it is a sign that he is welcome. At least I know that if I go there, they won't, they won't look at me different because of the color of my skin. I just wish that the world should be a better place and equal opportunities, especially for us blacks. And uh, there's a lot of discrimination going on, a lot of hatred, and uh, we're really hoping that there should be change coming. So far, the church has not received any backlash about their statement from the community. They say their goal is not to offend others, but to bring about unity. We wanted to be that little bit of PG County that people could stop by and say, that's that's the that's what I believe in. For Laurel TV, Stephanie Johnson.